As we know, some gases have a highly toxic effect on the human body and can have deadly consequences at high levels. Let's now examine a gas that we are very familiar with and without which we would not exist. Which gas do we need to exist? Can you think which gas this might be? Type in your answer and then select Submit. Which gas do we need to exist? Oxygen is vital for us to exist. It is absorbed into the bloodstream and circulates around the body to our vital organs. However, the amount of oxygen available in the atmosphere can have different effects on us. Usually, humans can function perfectly normally with oxygen levels between 19% to 23% by volume in air. Select each of the oxygen concentration levels to identify some of the symptoms of oxygen deficiency. Whilst oxygen deficiency can be very dangerous, oxygen enrichment can be equally so. What causes oxygen enrichment? Type in your answer and then select Submit. What causes oxygen enrichment? Oxygen levels in the atmosphere can increase due to a leak in a compressed oxygen system, such as oxypropane cutting equipment. This is particularly dangerous if the occurrence happens in a confined space and if the levels of oxygen increase to above 23%, this can have a dangerous effect on the human body. Symptoms of oxygen enrichment include visual disturbances such as tunnel vision, auditory anomalies such as ringing ears, nausea and dizziness, twitching especially of facial muscles and sudden mood changes such as irritability or euphoria. Sometimes people who have been affected by oxygen enrichment act as if they're drunk and this can have an effect on their decision-making abilities. This can be especially dangerous within a confined space where the access and egress may be restricted. As the AGT, it is your responsibility to check that the initial oxygen levels are between 19% and 23% before work begins. Ideally, they should be 21%. Continuous monitoring of the atmosphere within a confined space is essential to provide early warning of any risk of oxygen enrichment. Let's try an exercise to test your understanding of the effects that oxygen enrichment can have on the human body. Select the three images that represent symptoms of oxygen enrichment. When you are happy with your answers, select the Submit button. We have seen the effects that oxygen enrichment can have on the human body, but there is also another serious danger when an atmosphere becomes enriched with oxygen above a level of 23%. What other dangers are posed by oxygen enrichment above 23%? Can you think of other dangers that an oxygen-enriched environment might create? Type in your answer and then select the Submit button. What other dangers are posed by oxygen enrichment above 23%? Even a small increase in the oxygen level in the air above 23% can create a very dangerous situation. With oxygen levels above 23%, it becomes very easy to start a fire. The fire will then burn hotter and more fiercely than in air with lower oxygen levels and may become almost impossible to extinguish. A leaking valve or hose in a poorly ventilated room or confined space can quickly increase the oxygen concentration to dangerous levels. In addition, some materials react explosively if they come into contact with pure oxygen at high pressure and other materials such as lubricants can catch fire spontaneously. The risk to personnel working in an oxygen-enriched environment is that their clothing and hair can catch fire very easily and will burn very quickly, causing extensive damage to the body. This damage caused by an oxygen-enriched environment can easily be fatal.